Paris Saint-Germain continued their solitary charge at the top of the Ligue 1 Uber Eats standings and they were able to dispatch a tough opponent in reigning champions Lille who travelled to the Parc des Princes. Boudak Yilmaz served Jonathan David on a platter for the opening goal of the match. The Canadian with his eighth goal of the season. Paris struggled in the opening 45 minutes of the game but after the interval the Parisians showed their new resolve under Mauricio Pochettino and Gelti Maria playing the ball to Marquinhos and the captain, the Brazilian, with the equalising goal. The Argentine was then the goal scorer and the match winner for Paris in the 88th minute. And Gelti Maria combining with Neymar, the Brazil-Argentina connection once again working. And Di Maria with the winning goal to give Paris an eight-point lead at the top of the standings. Closing in behind them is Nice. Christophe Galtier's side didn't start the match against Angers in the best possible fashion. Sofiane Bouffal fouled and a penalty awarded to the former Southampton man. Up he stepped and a penalty perfectly converted by Bouffal. Nice with a lot of work to do in the second half but as always they were able to rely on their star striker Andy Delors the Algerian a little bit lucky with the first goal a goal that brought both teams level but if he was lucky with the first one there was nothing lucky about the winning strike an absolutely beautiful goal by Andy Delors Nice move up into second place in the championship eight points behind Paris and they're now unbeaten in the last three Marseille also continue their progress under Jorge Sampaoli. One goal by Senghis Unda was enough to dispatch promoted outfit Clermont in the first ever meeting between both teams in the French top flight. A brilliant goal by the Turkish international. Marseille now unbeaten in their last four. And after back-to-back -back draws, it was good for OM to get the win. Could have been even worse for them as Arthur Desmas made a string of fine saves and Arkadius Milik hit the crossbar. Nonetheless, the final score between Clermont and Marseille 1-0 to the south of France team. Lance travelled to the Coupama Stadium to challenge Lyon. For the home side, we're awarded an early penalty. Clear foul on Bruno Guimaraes. And the spot kick, calmly converted by Carl Toko Ikambi to give Lyon a one-goal lead before the break. A one-goal lead, which then turned into a two-goal lead. Sam Awa combining with Carl Toko Ikambi, whose shot was parried by Jean-Louis Lec, but Awa alert enough to tuck in the rebound with a header. Those two first-half goals, enough for Lyon to win the match, even though Cali Mwendo scored his 10th Ligue 1 Uber Eats goal, becoming the youngest player since Kylian Mbappe to do so. The final score in that one, 2-1 for Lyon. Bruno Genesio's Rennes were on a seven-game unbeaten streak in all competitions, and they travelled to Troyes, looking to make it a six-win on the trot. Aguez header seemed to be setting Rennes on their way. But Adil Rami, the French World Cup winner in 2018, scored the equaliser as he headed in his first goal for Troyes. The home side took the advantage just before the break as Diamande tucked in from close range. Alfred Gomez unable to keep the ball out. Rennes showed their resourcefulness in the second half as former Lyon man Martin Terrier struck in the equaliser with a crisp shot they extend their unbeaten run to eight games trois a 14th strasbourg have been one of the better sides in recent weeks in the french top flight and they wasted no time in taking the lead against lorient at the stade de la Meno. ludovic ajorc heading in his sixth goal of 2021 no player has done better in the Ligue 1 Uber Eats. A Lorient defence, which was completely 
missing during this game as Abib Diallo scored a second shortly afterwards and then a beautiful third on the stroke of half time to guarantee all three points for Julien Stefan's team. Strasbourg made it even worse for Lorient in the second half as Adrien Domasson tucked in a fourth. They move up into seventh place in the championship, whereas Lorient dropped down to 13th. Montpellier and Nantes, a duel between two sides accustomed to be playing in the Ligue 1 Uber Eats. Tashi Savanier involved, but it was Florent Mullet who scored the opening goal for Montpellier in the second half against Nantes. An element of luck in the build-up with a deflection which took the ball past Albon Lafont. Nothing lucky about the second goal as Wahi tucked in through the legs of the French goalkeeper to make it 2-0 for Montpellier and secure all three points for Michel Dezakarian. Brest, we're still looking for their opening win of the 2021-2022 campaign. And Steve Mounier tucked in their first goal of the afternoon against Monaco in the 18th minute. The Benin striker with his second goal of the season. In the second half, Brest kept on coming forwards. The ball neatly worked to Franck Honora and the club's top scorer adding another goal to his tally to secure Brest's first win of the campaign and heap on more misery on Niko Kovac. Bordeaux took on Reims at the Mahmoud Atlantic and it was the visitors who scored the opening goal of the match. Ekatike tucking in the ball from close range. VAR confirming that the goal stood no offside in the build-up. A little bit of a lucky opening goal but there was nothing lucky about the second. Loco with his first goal for Haas and his first Liga Uber Eats goal with that absolute beauty. Costil, no chance. And after 63 minutes, Haas two goals up and seemingly cruising to taking all three points against Bordeaux. But Jimmy Briand's introduction started the revolt for the home side. Adley, who has recently signed for AC Milan, tucking in the first goal. And that was enough to spark a magical comeback for the Girondins. Briand scoring in a 17th Ligue 1 Uber Eats season with that strike. An important occasion for the French striker who marked his 500th appearance in European top flight leagues. And he was then handed the opportunity to score the winning goal as the referee awarded a penalty for a handball in the build-up. Jimmy Briand, a man of his experience, one you would trust. And trust rewarded as he got a brace. Final score, 3-2 for Bordeaux. The duel between the bottom teams in the Ligue 1 Uber Eats standings, Mess against Saint-Étienne, 19 against 20th. And it was the 19th place team who took the lead at the Stade saint symphorien Barry Boulaya with a good goal from a free kick, even though Etienne Green could have perhaps done a little bit better to keep that one out. And if you thought Boulaya's goal was good, well, watch this from Wabi Kazri, the Tunisian who scored what will undoubtedly be the goal of the season. Absolutely sensational superlatives. Cannot describe that strike by Wabi Kazri. Levert, star player, coming up with another big moment for his team. It's absolutely sensational. There were no more goals in the game. Won all the final score. And both teams remain bottom of the standings. We're looking at all the results in week 12. That all-important victory for Paris Saint-Germain against Lille, 2-1. Lyon also with a 2-1 victory against Lens. Same scoreline for Nice against Angers, even though that one was away from home. And Brest with their first win of the season. Paris stretched their lead at the top of the standings to eight points. It's now Nice and Marseille who complete the podium of the Ligue 1 Uber Eats. In the bottom half of the table, no changes right at the bottom as Saint-Étienne and Metz remain 20th and 19th. Brest, however, with a little bit more breathing space as they get their first win. Reims and Bordeaux in the danger zone. Looking ahead at week 13, Lens will host Troyes before Paris travel 
to Bordeaux. Marseille then hosts Metz and it will be Rennes against Lyon in Brittany.